Missy Missy, welcome everyone, welcome. I am Selena Garrick, the virtual alchemist and virtual idol in training, and welcome to the potion shop today. We're not, uh, we're not actually in the potion shop today. We are actually, um, this is, this is, uh, <laughs> it's hard to explain with this game, but, um, instead of being in the potion shop today, you're actually going to be playing this game on, uh, <laughs> on, on my desktop. I'm kind of worried about this, but I think I've, I think I've gotten rid of anything that I could dox myself with. <laughs> IK, are you eliminating some competition? No, no, no. We're going to be helping, we're going to be helping an, an, another NPC. Uh, we're going to be helping out another NPC today. We're not, we're not, we're not Yandere Sylvan today. Don't worry, don't worry. I, <laughs> I'm, I am, I'm kind of worried because this, I had to do a lot of last minute things to make sure this is all in working order. So hopefully everything goes well. <laughs> okay. I am really nervous. <laughs> But, okay. But, hey there. My name is the screen that warns you not to leak your private info on stream. But my friends simply call me Ash Midai, the Destroyer. Legends were told you might be recording slash streaming the screen. Just wanted to let you know, this game really does run on your real desktop. The game only runs on your main screen, so make sure it doesn't contain anything you don't want to be caught in your recording. Hmm. <laughs> I think I have everything taken care of. Okay, Ashmeda, I am ready to take this relationship to the next level. Let's go. What? It closed out my OBS. Hello? What? No, you guys are alive still. Okay, good. Didn't we learn from Caster? <laughs> It'll be fine. I'm sure she's a friendly one. My file. A file, a file. Wait, was that not it? This one? Oh, you're so small. Hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> you you have humongous entertainment sound effects. Hello? Hi. Uh, my name is Lumi. You must be the owner of this place, right? Uh... No, technically... Technically, I live inside of Reyna's computer. So, no. Oh, I wonder who it belongs to. At least it's nice knowing I'm not the only stranger here. Hmm <laughs> hmm. Oh, I didn't let you introduce yourself. What is your name? My name. My name is Sylvan. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, Sylvan. Uh, oh, you can see that. <laughs> what? Hold on. I need to turn the volume down a bit. Wow, this is scary. This is really actually scary. Uh, I, I want to thank you for helping me. Uh, that thing you gave me, I, I think it was a part of myself. Up until you gave it to me, I didn't even remember my own name. And to be honest, I'm still not sure how I got here, or what just happened before I got here. But there's one thing I can tell you for sure. This file thing is not the only one around. There are more files like this scattered around your world. If the first one restored some of my memories, then perhaps the others will restore the rest. I don't know this place. It's not something I can do alone. Will you please help me find my other files? Of course. <gasps> Thank you so much. It's a big relief knowing that I'm not alone in this situation. Let's go. Uh, the next file's location is... Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure about the exact location, but I can sense its presence in a place called My Computer or Quick Access. Can you get us there? Uh, it's in my files, isn't it? Uh, <laughs> uh, 
I don't think I have anything bad in here. I think it's fine. No, it's all <laughs> it's all thumbnail assets. Don't worry, don't worry. <sighs> the presence is stronger now. We're getting closer. It's in a place called Document. <laughs> I'm sure of it. It? Oh no no this is the OneDrive this is not it hold on wrong documents folder uh, it's it's <gasps> this one Lumi data the same thing as last time drop the file onto me okay I have nothing to hide I'm fine I'm fine I'm fine <laughs> I can I can get rid of the archive if I need to it's not working. This file is different than the last one, it's encrypted. It's not going to merge back into me unless we manually decrypt it. I think I can do that, but you'll have to do it with me. Let's begin. I'm gonna close this now. <laughs> uh, what's that sound? <laughs> what? Uh, what is this thing? <laughs> is that a safe with three light bulbs indicating we need to solve three challenges? What, is it supposed to be symbolic or something? And look at that, there's a keyhole. It has the shape of a star-shaped cookie cutter. I'm good at guessing the shapes of silhouettes. How do we get a key? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I know. Here, let me try something. We're gonna create- oh, you opened it. <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you, Lumi. Uh, we're going to create one. I'm not sure what this- thing I just opened this, but it looks like you can paint in it. Try painting a key that would fit the keyhole shape. It doesn't have to fit exactly. It should be small enough to fit inside the shape, but big enough to count as a key. I created a new image file on your desktop called lumisafekey.png. Thank you, Lumi. So once you're done, simply save your drawing and then I'll create the key. Good luck. make this a little bit bigger. Uh... Wait, I can just do this, can't I? <gasps> Does this work? This feels like cheating. <laughs> Save. Key is way too big. Ah, okay. Hmm. Try drawing a key using a smaller image. Can I restart? <laughs> there. That should be good. It's still too big? No, it's not. That's almost perfect. Try drawing a key using a smaller image. You need to crop it. There we go, okay. Now try to fit the key into the keyhole. Key fits, but it's not dense enough. <laughs> what do you mean it's not dense enough? What if I... Uh... Oh, does it need to be colored in? Let's see, let's see. There we go. Oh, <laughs> set it on my ass. Mm -hmm. Well done. The first light bulb turned on and the key all changed. Now, it obviously looks like a spaceship and absolutely nothing else. You know what to do about it. Good luck. Oh, uh, how do I draw that? That's not fair. <laughs> I'm not the best, I'm not the best at drawing.
Uh. How do I... Can I make this smaller? Uh, I, I've never used Microsoft Paint. smaller a little bit smaller no uh okay I have this Ah, okay, good, good, good. The mugs is kind of fat for the safe. It fit. I made it fit. I made it fit. Second light bulb turned on and the keyhole changed once again. Now it looks like a big, empty... <laughs> Never mind. Just draw a fitting key. And let's move on. Where the last one was surprisingly easy. I just used the same one. <laughs> I now have the ability to open my file. Before we open my memory, I got a question. I couldn't help but notice that, uh... Is that a camera? Are you recording me right now? Oh no, don't tell me you're... <laughs> no, 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 no. I... No, Shaysa. Yeah, I've heard all about perverts. I heard they like... Okay, mm-hmm. I shouldn't have streamed this game. <laughs> The star goes into the square hole. The mogus goes into the square hole. <laughs> Do you know where this shape goes? That's right. It goes into the square hole. You're thinking, I'm not a pervert. Don't, 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 don't. I don't want to become a pillow. Though you did help me so far. So I guess you're not interested in turning me into a pillow. No, no, of course not. Of course not. Uh, sorry about that. Let's continue. Once I start the decryption process, my memories will appear in front of us. I'll have to take control of my body in, in the memory and successfully reach the end. Hmm? What was that? I know you can do it. Let's go. Someone only wants to turn himself into a pillow. Uh, when you're ready, just drag me into the memory window. What? Oh my god, it's so cute. Ah. Uh, What? Eh? It's me, your boy, Eshmedai. <laughs> Eshmedai the story. Listen, you, you and I were best buddies. And you know what best buddies do together? That's right. They share their favorite platforming keyboard layouts with each other. Yeah, all the kids, all the cool kids do that. So, um, how about you go first? Well, uh, I like, I prefer Wazd. Mm -hmm. This is how my story begins. This is Lumi. Her biggest wish is to leave the underground and explore above. Wake up, Lumi. Look. <gasps> she has a bouncy castle in her room. Good morning, Lumi. Say hello to everyone. Today is Lumi's 18th birthday. That means she can finally decide her own fate. Oh my gosh, she has a bouncy castle in her room. Yeah, I want one. Uh, hey, Loom, do you want to go on an epic adventure today and make your dream come true? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> What's going on? Dad, what are you doing? I'm not Dad, I'm... Captain Tutorial. <laughs> What are you wearing? Have you been watching too much anime again? Oh my god, the laugh. Yes. <laughs> I'm here to make sure you are ready for your adventure. We'll begin by teaching you how to move. 
First start by moving your right foot in front of your left foot. Amazing. It may have taken 18 years, but he finally learned how to walk. But can you figure out how to jump using the space button? <gasps> Unbelievable! You actually figured it out! You proved without a doubt that you're ready for the three deadly challenges. Well, let's start with the candy-themed obstacle course. <laughs> uh, not this again. Your task is to reach the end of the obstacle course. Let's hear what the crowd thinks. <laughs> you can- you can- you can do it. Yeah, only Lumi can navigate this deadly can- can- Candy Con Fluffy Puffy obstacle course. Looks like the crowd is rooting for you, Lumi. Don't disappoint them. Uh, don't I get a say in this? See you on the other side. Okay, bye, Dad. <laughs> bye. What? What? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to get used to these these jumps. Uh, okay. 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 Oh, jumping is so weird. Dash left mouse button. What? <laughs> no, I'm not doing this on purpose. It's only the tutorial. thing that shows your his dash. Oh, nice. Okay. What? What? Hold on. Okay. <laughs> this is harder than it looks. Uh, okay. Got it. Got it. Is it me or does Lumi have way too many physics? She's very bouncy. Ah. Uh, uh. It's a little hard to control. It's almost like rage game controls. Oh, no! Oh. oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> got it, got it. Maybe you really aren't trying. I'm not. I'm not. Oh, bouncing. It's all training. <gasps> oh, okay. She has to level up before she goes on that adventure. Uh, oh no. <laughs> the trumpet man. <laughs> well done, Lumi. You've cleared the obstacle course. I'm so proud. <laughs> Thanks. Not as impressive as... Now, as, as impressive as it may be, you will not get to the surface just by walking. You need something to protect yourself with out there. Which is exactly why you need the tutorial hat. What is that? <laughs> the tutorial hat? Yes, you heard it right. The tutorial hat. Woven from the finest silk, silky rock in the underground, and designed by the smartest engineers in tutorial core. It'll make you look stylish and protect your head from the cold. Indeed, the tutorial hat has everything you need to help you on your journey. Why well, tell you when I can show you how awesome it is? Let's watch a commercial showcasing the tutorial hat. It's Trubal. Sure. Nigma Ramelafefon. 
What language is this? Tagilia y ponimta afiko man. Hafat bumi. Ken ken ken. Abra kanda abra majadura. Om bala intelligencia vetam shil pdidim. Ah, ni masli le dovev. Oi, kach ze. Shalom. Bati le dovev. Zuz zuz shiniti edati. Pavav. Nu eta pova de oshani eta be. Fascinating, isn't it? Get your own hat. <laughs> get get your own hat only from now on and until the end of supply of one hat. <laughs> wow, how do I get this hat? Why, I'm glad you asked. All you need to do is pay a certain amount of score points, which you can collect from this challenge I set up just for you. This is pinball. <laughs> this is pinball. <laughs> Did Dad make this commercial? I think Dad made everything. Your second deadly challenge is to earn enough score points to buy this hat. T okay, it looks like I need 2,000. <laughs> Whopping zero, <laughs> zero horsepower. <laughs> the recommended price of the tutorial hat in regular retailers is 2,000 score points. And this kind of price can usually reach 1,000 score points, but hold on. Unbelievable. I've just been told we've got a new deal just for you, Lil. <laughs> Why? That's more. <laughs> That's right. Only five thousand points, and you can have your very own tutorial hat. But can you do it? Let's hear what the crowd thinks. You can do it, Lumi. Yeah, only Lumi has it in her to support the endless, un unsustainable cycle of capitalism. We believe in you. Well then, Lumi. Looks like the crowd is rooting for you. Don't disappoint them. What? Oh my God! I'm a human pinball. <gasps> Oh, this is gonna make me sick. <laughs> I have to get 5,000 points? That's gonna take so long. Okay, okay. How, how am I gonna do this? What? Oh, shoot. Unlock the experience from Sonic Adventure? I never played Sonic Adventure! I haven't played any Sonic games, actually. Oh! What happened? Oh, I want to do that over. Wait, I want to do that over. Ah, I made it, I made it, I made it. There was a level in Sonic Adventure that was just like this. Mm -hmm. Well done, Lumi. You successfully earned 5,000 or more points. Your hat will be delivered to you in 12 business days. Aren't you supposed to take my money? That didn't answer anything. Stop right there, villain. Villain? That's right. You're the one who put these people in the bur burning buildings, aren't you? Well, fear not, everyone. I, Captain Tutorial, shall defeat the villain and save the burning citizens. In that particular order. I'm burning to death. So what's going on? Before I annihilate you, let's hear what the crown has to say. Oh my god. Don't worry, villain. There are other helpless citizens stuck in this building. Before I defeat you and save them, I must change to my battle suit. 
Get ready, it's tutorial time. Now that I have got my battle suit on, you will not be able to come evil. Did you, did, did you even change? <laughs> God. Your last deadly challenge is to defeat me, and as a lesson I shall teach you how to fight. How do I fight? Ugh. Oh my god, dad. Dad, dad. I don't want to play this game anymore. <laughs> Oh my god, Dad, I didn't want to do this tutorial. Ow. He's not even teaching me how to fight, he didn't tell me. He's just beating me up. Jesus, let's get the boss fight. No, we're not doing that. Ugh, I keep hitting my head on those stars. Ah, no. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, 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 okay. I can do this, I can do this. I got him. I got a hit on him. I'm not trying to limit the competition. I'm, <laughs> I'm not that kind of NPC. <sighs> I missed. I missed. Got him. Everyone. Well done, Lily. You did it. Dad. Why did I have to go through this? Well, it's because of the unknown dangers that lie in the world above. Ever since you found that photo as a child, all you've been talking about was exploring that world. The one with the scenery I have never seen before? 
and a text written on it that said Tulumi from the world above. How could I not want to explore the world above after that? Exactly. I didn't want you to have this dream, and that's why I confiscated the photo. We don't know anything about the world above, and because of that, we can only assume it's not safe. Most people who went to explore the world above never came back, and those who did have no longer been the same. They never told us what they saw out there. I didn't want you to end up like them. I didn't want you to... I didn't want to lose you or anyone ever again. I wasn't stupid. I knew making you drop that dream is beyond my ability. So I decided to use the time we have left to have some fun. This wasn't fun. <laughs> and also to make sure you're ready for the world above. These tasks proved without a doubt that you are. You've really grown up to be a capable adventurer, Lumi. Aww. Come on now, I know you had fun. <laughs> yeah, the pinball part was fun. Now before you go, have one last laugh with me. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> By the way, I have something for you. Catch. Yeah, it's exactly what I remember it to be. Thanks, Dad. I'll be going now. Can we have the tutorial hat? I kind of wanted that tutorial hat. Uh, goodbye, Lumilia, and good luck. Mm-hmm. Ugh. Keeps closing on my OBS. Ah, so this is how it all started. And that was my dad. Wait a bit, what about the tutorial hat? I guess we're gonna have to wait the 12 business days. Oh god. I just realized that means you know my dad now. I swear, he's not always dressed like that. <laughs> it's just that he's always so overdramatic and easily influenced. He once saw a TV show called Mr. Chef and decided that he's a world-class food artist. He ended up burning our house. Three times. <laughs> he's so embarrassing, but behind all that mess, he's actually a good dad who cares about me. Anyway, thanks for helping me recover that memory. I feel just a little bit more whole now. Say, would you like for us to continue looking for my files? I knew you were going to say that. I knew you were going to say that, Rena. <laughs> as soon as I read that line, I knew you were going to say that. We can also take a break if you'd like. Oh, let's continue looking for files. As long as they're, like, nowhere private. <laughs> I can't pinpoint the exact location, but... I think the file resides in a folder where you downloaded download things from the outside world. Mm -hmm. Let me think for a moment. <laughs> Let me, let me move. Let me double check if there's anything in here. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. We're fine. <laughs> Is there unsafe so items in there? No, there isn't. It's clean. It's fine. Uh, Lumi's website. What is that? Oh, wait, what is this? Oh my god. <laughs> Hold on. Let me move this over. <laughs> I don't have any prawn. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Only GeoCities. It does. It does look like GeoCities. It's not my memory file, but I feel like my file is within it. Can you try opening it and seeing and see if you can find the file? <laughs> Mr. Tutorial's here. Ha 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 ha. Now that's my girl. Daughter is the best daughter of all daughters in the underground. Oh, 0% off, no returns. Hot and moist bag of trash in your area. Stop being lonely. Click here. Mm. I'm I'm very tempted. Oh, okay, it took me to Outcore website. <laughs> <laughs> uh, making a website was nice, but I feel like it's not really my thing. Maybe I should start singing. Perhaps, a, perhaps pursue a career as an underground pop singer. I decided to go ahead and record myself. I really like how it came out and how it represents a big part of me. You download my new song over here. I call it E. 
Oh, you're downloading a file. Eh? No, wait, don't do that. Don't do that. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. <laughs> wait, 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 where's my downloads? <gasps> is this a file you're looking for? <gasps> oh, it is. Yep, I thought so. This file is also encrypted, though it appears to be somewhat different. There seems to be something attached to it that can be used to decrypt the file. I will need your help this time. Here, let me open it up. What is this? This thing sure is strange. Luckily, it comes with a guidebook. Let's see. Hmm, I see. Yes, of course, it all makes sense. Wait, what are you supposed to do with that? Oh, yeah, sure. Okay, I'm done. I'm gonna get straight to the point. This is a game. <laughs> Apparently, the key to the script my file will be revealed after winning this game. Your goal is to collect coins. You can buy all sorts of things using coins, and one of them happens to be our decryption key. I assume at this point, you must wonder how can you collect coins, right? Well, you do that by first moving the character over the coin. But collecting coins with your worker doesn't mean you own those coins. In order to truly own them, you need to you need your worker to stand on a coin collector like the one over here. Uh, the catch is that you don't move the character yourself. You have something else move it for you, and it's not going to be me. Oh, this is an idle game. Try, try hitting play and see what happens. Did you see that? The character just moved by itself. It grabbed the coin, but it didn't walk far enough to drop it at the coin collector. You may not be able to play the character directly, but there is another way for you to control it. Oh, this seems very complicated. <laughs> Having to program in order to decrypt files. Sylvan, did you ever write a program before? A long, 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 long time ago. <laughs> uh, really, that's so cool. I don't think I got to meet any programmers in the underground. And even if I did, they would probably write the same Hello World program over and over. You're better than them, I'm sure of it. That's how you were born, it was. You're right, you're right. Oh, I want to tell you something about myself. You probably didn't know this about me, but I'm actually a programmer myself. Thank <laughs> you. And I'm going to teach you how to write the super sophisticated artificial intelligence needed in order to win this game. You already know how to program, but it's probably a good idea if I teach you this game's language. If, really, if you really don't want to, you can always just tell me and I'll write the code for you instead. Uh, I don't want to learn. First, allow me to explain how this game works, and you can decide whether you want to play it or not. Let's begin. Oh, I gotta learn JavaScript! <laughs> uh, I never learned JavaScript. This folder is the location of your script. See this worker onetxt file that contains code for your script. Here, let me open it for you. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Now, unless you were... You already touched it, there should be a single command side. Move forward. Oh my gosh. It's okay, it'll look good on your NPC resume. Now it seems that a single step <laughs> I can't I can't put this on my resume. <laughs> Now it seems that a single step forward is not enough to fully collect the coin. You'll need to order... Mm -hmm. Got it, okay. One last thing. After you collect enough coins, you need to buy access to the next stage to the game store. Try opening the store. Oh my god, there's so many things I need to open. I lost it. Where where is it? Here it is. This is a game store where you'll be able to spend coins and buy different useful things. In order to win the game, you'll have to complete four stages. Uh, I don't have the patience for this. 
So what do you say? Would you like to try it out? I'll give it a try. Good luck. Okay. There's so many windows open. Okay, 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 okay. So I need to move forward. One, two, three, four. So if I do this... That should do it. Right? Yeah, save changes. One, two, three, four. <gasps> okay, okay, okay. And then buy stage two. You did it. Now you can brag to your friends about being a real programmer. And as a real programmer, you are now tasked with solving the second stage. I'll give you a hint. Walking straight over and over again won't be enough this time. We need to- what you do need is a new command to help you. Open the store. I have to buy a new command? Aside from purchasing access, you can browse by different upgrades. Some of these upgrades are mandatory, while others are nice to have. The stage offers one upgrade, turn right command. When used, the worker will turn 9 degrees right and face that direction. Mmm. This combined with the move floor command gives you the freedom to move the worker wherever you want. Why can't I just type it in? Okay, okay. Hmm. Okay. So if we go... Uh, <laughs> there's so many windows open. Move forward. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then it was turn right and then move one, two, three, four, five, six. So copy all that and then turn right again. Oh, no, 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 no. Turn right. And then one, two, three, wait. One, two, three, four. Dun, 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 dun. I'm glad they're playing Wolf Eye Beats at least. It's very relaxing to work too. Alright, let's try it. Bum, bum, bum. Stage complete. JavaScript is easy. <laughs> it is. Looks like you're getting the hang of this. Just two stages left. Good luck. Can I... Is, are there more commands I can buy? Technically, I don't need turn left. It'd just be easier. This looks complicated? No, this should be easy, I think. Okay, okay. Turn. Right. One. Two. No, wait, wait. One, two, three. Turn right. If I just do this and do it three times. Two, three, 
and then move forward one and then another time <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is right <laughs> and then we want to turn right another three times <laughs> And then move forward. One, two, three, four. Yeah, four. Okay. One, two, three, four. Wait, no, no, no. One, two, three, four. Okay, now that's right. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna turn right another three times. This is simple, I swear. <laughs> Move forward one, two, three, four times. Then turn right once. Forward two times. Right one more time. And that's forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, first try, first try, first try. <gasps> I miscounted. <laughs> Hold on, I need one more forward. I was so close! I was so close. Oh, no, no, no. One more, one more move forward. Okay, first try, first try, first try. I can't believe I was like one step short. Uh, let's get that one. And then let's also buy turn left because it was a pain to do. Turn right three times. Oh, uh, well, well, well. Would you look at that? No coding challenge is safe when it comes to you. This is going to be the last stage. There's one last thing I have to teach you before you're able to get the decryption key. The, pri the price of the decryption key goal is significantly more expensive than the previous goal. It would require you to manually complete the stage over and over again, which isn't very practical. Lucky luckily, there's a special command that can solve that problem for you. It's called a while loop. Remember how your code runs step by step like a cooking recipe? The program run stops running once the last command is executed. While using a while loop, you can... Oh, I know this, I know this, I know this. <laughs> yeah. So using this, I can make the code keep going and going and going until... Until I have... Until I have all the coins I need. How's the virtual girl on your computer doing, Sullivan? She's teaching me how to code in JavaScript. <laughs> also, you don't need to buy the while true command. Now I believe you should be ready. Good luck. You killed her many times. Only a couple of times. Only a couple of times and they weren't all my fault. A 
Oh, wow, this is very educational. I remember these from my, like, uh, coding days. I need 35 coins. Hmm. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Well, true. Uh... Oh no, okay, this might- this might be too over my head. <laughs> oh, I haven't done this in so long. I need to turn around, don't I? So first, let's turn right twice. And then move forward and we'll test, we'll see what happens. Okay. All right. Okay. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay, that's not right. That's not what's supposed to happen. Let me see that script again. One, two. Let's move forward one more time. And we're gonna turn this while loop off for now. I don't know what that button does. That yellow button, so I'm gonna try and figure that out real quick. Okay. So it looks like that resets the coins. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, so I need it to go and collect the coins, so... Uh, forward, forward. That's... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine forwards. Turn right. That's one turn right. And then two forwards. And then... Oh, <laughs> uh, that should be two rights. One, two, three, four, five. But uh, my brain is melting. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Five forwards. And then turn left. To turn left. Ugh, I, I when I booted up this game, I didn't think I'd be learning programming today. And then one, two, three, four, five, six forwards. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. No. Two more. And that should get us to the money bin. I'm still confident. I'm still confident. Programming takes a lot of, a lot, a lot of patience and trial and error. Which is why I stopped. <laughs> which is why I stopped learning it. <laughs> what? Shaisa. Okay, stop, stop, stop. You're broken. I need one more forward. 
here. Programming is just is just replaying the same script over and over and over and over and over and over until it finally works. Okay, 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 okay. So we have it. No, actually, we still need to get... We still need to get to... Get it to loop. Which shouldn't be too hard. Restart, actually. Restart that. We don't need to loop the part where he turns around. And moves forward once. So let's separate that a bit. We don't need that in the loop. Actually, no, no, actually. We can put another forward in there. So that's the introduction. After he gets to the thing, we want him to... After he drops off the coins, we want him to turn left. Turn left. Move forward one, two, three times. Okay. We're gonna take this, put it here. This. Put this here. We'll get rid of this here. I don't have to tab these all over, but I like it for aesthetics. Ah, oh, this brings back so many <laughs> memories of learning coding. Say well true. <sighs> there we go. This should work. And if it doesn't, I'm gonna be very <laughs> I'm gonna be very upset. Unexpected token. Mm -hmm. Okay, we don't need that there. Okay, now this should work, yes. Restart. Go. Wait, 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 why didn't you turn? Stop, 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 stop. You didn't turn left. You didn't turn left. Why didn't you turn left? Restart, 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 restart. Why are you broken? <laughs> oh, I forgot to do the turn left. I forgot. Okay, I need one more turn left and then it should be fixed. Okay, this should work. The only problem is, he only drops off one coin per turn. I think I saw- yeah, do nothing. If I buy this, and then put it into... Have him do nothing for five turns. When he's on the coin thing, I should be able to drop off all those coins. Otherwise, we're gonna be here forever. Okay. We're gonna do, do nothing. And we're gonna do that for five turns. Okay. 
Okay. I'm gonna lose my mind. Okay, good. Good so far. It's working! It's working! It's working! It's working! It's working! Oh my god! This is this is the best part of programming. <laughs> this is the best part of programming when like after hours of getting your <laughs> hours of like trial and error, like your code finally works. Hey Sylvan, I got a question. What's your question? So uh, it's kind of boring waiting for the stage to complete, huh? God, I love waiting. I love waiting. I built this. <laughs> I'm so proud. What? What? I mean, yes, yes, of course. I do love waiting myself. Uh huh. -huh. So while while we wait together, here's a question: Do you like eating food? <laughs> no, I prolong my existence by consuming pure electricity. I eat virtual food, so I feel like my answer is a cross between these two. <laughs> Uh, yum, 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 yum. <laughs> I wish I could remember if I like eating. I wonder what's my favorite food. I think it's co co coins. <laughs> no, that doesn't make sense. Then perhaps my least favorite food is gold. Never mind, I can't figure it out. Oh, I'm so happy it works. <laughs> Do you also eat coins, Sylvan? <laughs> no. I'm not I'm not from that kind of game. Oh, I can buy it now. <gasps> gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give <gasps> I did it, I did it, I did it. I beat the game and got the decryption key. I can use it right now to unlock my memory. Before that, I got a surprise for you. Open the store. Okay. Ready? There are actually more stages. No. <laughs> Why? <laughs> well, I'm just kidding. It's true that there are more stages, but you don't actually have to play them. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You already have the key, so we can technically, so we technically can unlock my memories right now. But if you really enjoy the programming game, I want to play it a little bit more than you, and want to play it a little bit, play it a little more than you can. Just let me warn you: the next stages are more complicated and may require some more knowledge in programming. If you choose to keep playing, then it's not a commitment. You can always talk to me and, and start the decryption process. So what do you say? <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's decrypt the memories now. Good choice. Hey, Sylvan. Did you enjoy playing the idle game? That's a complicated question. <laughs> uh, hey, so did you enjoy playing the idle game? I it was fun when I when I beat it. <laughs> I'm happy you enjoyed it, but I gotta be honest here, I kind of hate it. I didn't realize it at first, but there's just so much grinding and repeating tasks in it. I can't understand the reason, but something about that irritates me. <laughs> These kinds of games are not for me. I think my personal opinion of the game doesn't matter as long as you had fun. But I did enjoy it after all because we played together. Though you played most- I played all of it. <laughs> anyway, I'm really eager to find out more about my past. So let's use the decryption key and lock my memory. What? <gasps> oh my god, it's a dog! Hello! Whoa, is that... Caleb, how did you get here? This is Caleb, he's my dog. Well, he's not a real dog. Oh my god, I love this music. He's a half-robot, half-mutant, half-dog, possessed by a soul of a handsome ancient demon lord. <laughs> he's a bit odd, but he's a reliable friend and a good boy. Right, Caleb? just poop on my desktop. K 
Caleb. Sad half robot, half mutant, half dog, possessed by soul of a handsome ancient demon lord noises. <laughs> Good boy. Oh. What? Uh. Hey, Caleb. <laughs> we tried unlocking one of my memory files and it summoned you. Any chance you have something to do with it? Hmm. Woof woof. Yes, I see. <laughs> woof woof woof. She said what? <gasps> woof. Ah, oh, I see now. I have no idea what he's saying. He just keeps barking the same thing. <laughs> I don't think even dogs can understand him. He's not too smart, but at least he's got a big heart. Let's try something else. Hey, Cal Caleb. Can you decrypt this memory file for me? Uh, Alright, then let's do this for real this time. Remember, you need to drag me into the memory loader once it opens. Let's go. <gasps> okay. What? Oh, I dropped her. What? Oh, we're back at home. Lumi, wake up. It's time for work. Hmm? It's time to start another day. Oh, she's little. Today I'll bring home 87 coins. The same as every day. The first three coins will spawn to the right. Aww. Now another one will drop from the left. And another four will spawn above this point. <sighs> I wish the spawn pattern for these coins wasn't the same every day. Well, everyone, it's time to eat. Stale. I wonder if there are edible things other than gold. <laughs> they, eat, they eat gold. <sighs> How long will we live in this bubble? Wake up, everyone. Wake up, everyone. Now is the time for us to explore the world above. Ah. Uh. Man, will this guy ever stop blabbering nonsense? I concur, my friend, who looks identically like me. It's not wrong. I just wish more people would realize the world above is worth exploring. Aww. She's an NPC stuck in a game like me. And they lived happily ever after. Until they died in, <laughs> until they died in a horrible traffic accident. The end. I read this book so many times, I wonder if I can recite it without using the book. I'll try it tomorrow. Good night. Lumi, wake up. It's time to work. It's time to start another day. Hmm? Hey, Lumi. Ophelia. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're finally back. How was your adventure? Was was Booty's big layer big and awesome? Mm-hmm, <laughs> you bet. I don't even understand why Dad forbid us from venturing into it, but I'll tell you all about it later. We should get going to work. Dad won't be happy if we don't bring some coins to eat for dinner. So they do eat coins! <laughs> yeah, I don't want that. So let's go. <laughs> the first three coins will spawn to the right. Another one will drop from the left. And three, four will spawn from above this point. Hey, let me forget about that. Look what I made. <laughs> wow, it's so big. Yep. Mm -hmm. it looks a bit unstable. Huh? Ugh. Ugh. 
while everyone is time to eat. I really don't want to eat this anymore. I'm sick of this bland taste. Oh, really now? I'll look deep into your food. <laughs> I snuck up some delicious non coiny food I found at Booty's Cave. What? Really? But I can't see it. Look deeper. I still can't see it. Stop holding back. Look deeper. <laughs> it's not there. Well, I guess I was wrong. I can't believe you actually fell for that, Lily. <laughs> Oops. Hey, who threw this at me? Oh my god, they're all the same person. <laughs> Wake up, everyone. Now is the time for us to explore the world above. Hey, why is everyone ignoring this guy? He's right. Do you really want to spend the rest of your lives rotting this dark place? Don't you want to break the routine and discover something new? Uh, they ignored you too. Yeah, they always ignore me. That's one of the reasons I hate this place so much. Oh. Come on, let's go home and help Dad bake some golden coin cookies. I don't trust he'll be able to do it by himself. <laughs> Lumi, aren't you tired of reading it over and over again? I probably did read it over a thousand times by now. Good, so ditch it. How about I tell you some stuff about the world above? <gasps> what? I had a little chat when, with Foodie when I visited his cave. Get this, apparently he was, actually was in the world above. He told me things I couldn't even begin to imagine exist. Things such as new colors that don't exist in the underground. Or the fact that there is no ceiling. Wow. There are no walls? You can walk wherever you want and there doesn't appear to be an end to it. Instead of a ceiling, there's a giant ball of light that hurts your eyes if you look at it. That sounds terrible. <laughs> I know, isn't it great? And it's not even the best thing about the world above. What's the best thing about it? Lumi. It's food. Apparently there are cookies made out of things other than coins. <gasps> what is to the faces in the portraits? Yeah, I think they grow on trees or, <laughs> trees or something. What are trees? I don't know. <laughs> Which is why on my next adventure, I'll be trying to reach the world above. And I'm going to leave tonight. <laughs> Believe in the me who believes in you. Mm-hmm. I know, but I don't want to waste any time. Uh, the world is something I want to see for myself. You confirm there really is more to the universe than our birthplace. Don't worry, Lumi. I promise I'll come back as soon as I can. And once I'm back, I'll tell you all about it. Uh, okay. Oh. Ophelia. Lumi, wake up. It's time to work. It's time to start another day. Oh. Hmm. That's so sad. That's so sad. this anymore kind of getting real yeah i was expecting i was expecting another platforming thing lumi every day is the same the same food the same people the same events the same dad person who never even once wished to experience anything new he's the most boring person in the entire underground <laughs> your dad is not boring <laughs> i don't know what you're talking about I don't feel alive when I go through the same loop every single day. Just like a fish that swims the same empty bowl every day until it dies. At least when you were here with me, my daily routine was slightly different. But you always run off to your adventures and leave me alone. If that's how my life is going to be, then I shouldn't have been born. No, 
how about we run off together? Run off? Yeah. Let's explore. The world above. I feel as if Booty knows about the world above, so it's a good idea to seek his advice. Why didn't she tell me where the entrance to his cave was? You are my dad. Huh? Ah! Oh my god, it's Undertale! <laughs> it's Undertale. <laughs> uh, how long have I been out? Hours? Minutes? Or maybe mere seconds? It doesn't really matter. I need to get out of here and find booty. This, <laughs> this place looks r ridiculous. I don't want to spend another second here. Where do I go? Oh my god, it is Undertale! <laughs> Booty the bootleg, howdy! Oh my god, that's why! Well, I'm, I'm Booty, Booty the bootleg. You must be new around here, right? Wait, did you just say Booty? You look nothing like what Ophelia told me. You're more like a shameless ripoff. Ripoff? Wow, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess only you'll have to do. See this number? This is your score. It is directly tied to your credit card. <laughs> directly tied to your credit card. The bigger your score is, the better life you can live. No, oh, gee, you look like you could use a bigger score. How about I help you? All you have to do is pay a little sum of score points, and your investment will grow tenfold. <laughs> Perhaps even ten tenfold. Hold together, Lumi. It will be worth it to learn about the world above. So what do you say? Would you like to invest a thousand score points? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Mm, what's the worst that could happen? Thank you very much. You can increase the returns on your investment by getting more investors to join an investment plan. The more investors you sign up, the more score points you can make. Here, let me give you a couple investors to sign up on the house. Uh, <laughs> this is so. This is such an elaborate. <laughs> See these? Use your face to try and catch as many chainsaw chain investors as you can. Oops, I missed ya. <laughs> are you trying to kill me? What? No, no. Yes, you are. Listen, I really don't have time for this. I heard you've been to the world above. I'm here because I want your advice so I can explore it. But if you don't intend to help me, then I've got no reason to stay here. Wait, please just listen. Okay, I admit it. I was trying to kill you. I did it so I could take your credit card <laughs> and save my family. Save your family? Yes. The truth is, I'm actually part of the royal family. <laughs> I am the prince of the kingdom of Bootland. Recently, the King's Counselor has been trying to take down the royal family in an attempt to take over the kingdom. My family has a large sum of My family- <laughs> I can't even read this. My family has a large sum of score points. I'm talking about at least a billion score points. Wow, that's a lot of score points. I've been trying to transfer the score points out of the country to keep it safe. But alas, the Counselor was quicker and fro froze our bank account. I know, what the I know a guy at the bank who can unfreeze the royal account. I need to bribe him with score points. He said he wouldn't do it unless I paid him a number of score points equivalent to your specific bank account's total sum of score points. Please, if you help me, I promise I will pay you back a hundred times the amount of score points you currently have. Don't help this poor soul in trouble, you heartless monster. <laughs> Give Woody your credit card. Okay, but well, okay. But well, the story's like so unbelievable that it has to be true. Right? Right? Thank you. Now I can finally save the kingdom of Bootland. Please hold on. I'll be right back.
Oh, hey, you're still here. Yeah? Listen, I started transferring the bribery funds to my banker, friend. And all of a sudden, your credit card got blocked. <laughs> this must have been caused by some kind of automatic anti-fraud system. Obviously, this is a false alarm. Say, could you please call your credit card company and ask them to unblock your credit card? I'm sure, I'm sure it's just a misunderstanding. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, it's me. Can you please unblock my credit card? Alright, it's unlocked. Thank you! <laughs> that was fun. Uh, whoa, uh... So we're gonna keep our bank account stuff. So it's not my- it's not my money. It's not my money. That's why it wasn't- It's Lumi's money. It's Lumi's money. It's fine. So this is why he won't let you buy stuff from me. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Say, Spongebob. How- <laughs> Spongebob. How about you go and park the car for me? Hey, listen. The credit card is not working again. I think it's been blocked once more. It's not blocked. I'm just out of score points. Oh. Well, I'm sure you've got another one. And I can't just let such an opportunity pass. So I'm going to take it from you. <laughs> Even does a flowy laugh. Uh, please just stop. I don't care why you're trying to steal my score points. But can you please tell me anything about the world above? Oh. I've never been to the world above. <laughs> what? So you really know nothing about it? Correct. Why did Ophelia lie to me? Well, I'm done here. Thanks for wasting my time. Uh, don't go just yet. I'm sure you've got more score points to spare. What are you gonna do? Stop me? You're nothing but a plagiarist bootleg that is barely stitched together. A mere faker. Faker? <laughs> I think you're the fake one around here. You want to go beyond the underground and explore the world above? You call me fake, yet you're nothing but a slave of someone else's desires. What do you mean? That photo you got is the reason you're going on this quest, right? First you kill her over and over and now you make her bankrupt. <laughs> I know, she's, she wasn't using those score points anyway. Uh, how do you know about that? Did you ever wonder why it reached your hand specifically? It's because I was the one who placed it where you could find it. <gasps> Wait, what? Though it's not my desire for you to reach the world above. I was simply following the orders I got from someone. Who gave you those orders? I don't feel like telling you. Then I'll beat it out of you. Now that's the attitude. <gasps> oh, okay. Boss fight. Oh my god, it's Photoshop Flowey! <laughs> How do I fight again? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> this is too much of a ripoff for me to deal with. How do I attack you? was easy. Well, it's like pinball again. Oh 
my god, even the song is a ripoff. Get up there. Oh, okay. Got it. Got it. I gotta jump off SpongeBob. Got him. <laughs> Come on, I need a good. I need a good jump. <gasps> nice. Oh god, he has a wizard hat! <gasps> oh, I can't- I can't get hit once. What? Oh my god, the ninja stars are so hard to dodge! Try, you try. Gosh, the ninja stars. Keep climbing, keep climbing, keep climbing. One life left, one life left. <laughs> keep going, keep going. I'm not killing you on purpose, I swear. Fun drop, no. Get away, get away. This is so stressful. <laughs>
Oh, it's going so fast! Please, please, please! Start all over. Where am I now? Okay, okay. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. <gasps> oh, I don't mind. I don't mind. <laughs> I believe that's instant death. Oh. <sighs> got him, got him, got him. No, 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 no! Don't fall, don't fall, don't you dare. Don't you dare fall. out the window. I clicked outside the window. Oh, I was doing so well the other time. Okay, go slow, maybe. Go slow. <laughs> darn it. Darn, 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 darn. I'm not trying I'm not trying to get rid of any other NPCs. You can tell this very guard just got to slip it skip it. I'm I won't I wanna beat it though. Don't panic, don't panic, don't panic, don't panic. No! Ah, oh, no, no, no. <gasps> no! Oh, I fell all the way back down. <laughs> no, the heart level is so hard! Did I win? Did I win? Did I win? Did I win? Oh, I won. I won. Ugh. It seems intense as heck. It was. It was. Hi, Jacob, by the way. <laughs> Welcome. This has such odd elements to it that I'm yet to understand. But I can obviously tell what's trying to kill you. <laughs> mm-hmm. I don't even know if I could explain the story up to this point. Uh, are you ready to tell me who gave you the photo? Oh. <laughs> Why are you crying? 
Your determination is truly touching. Please stop. <laughs> I'll tell you about the photo. Finally. On one condition. Damn it. I want to come with you to the world above. What? No. Please, take me. It's either that or I'm keeping the secret to myself. Uh, fine. <laughs> so about that photo. That photo was given to me by... A dog. It just appeared in my lair one day. The science mouse was this photo and a letter. The letter promised me a great fortune if I laid that photo at a specific spot on a specific time. Huh. Uh, that's it. I didn't even get paid for, for my hard work. I can't believe I'm somewhat surprised that information is actually useless. How am I supposed to believe that story? Whether the story is belie believable or not is not part of the deal. Now let's go. Fine, whatever. Let's go, I guess. Blech. Every time we go back to my desktop, it closes out OBS. Ah, there we go. Oh, that was a lot to take in. I can't believe I forgot about Ophelia. She was one person that understood my boredom. The last thing I remember of her is that we were about to go to the world above. I wonder what happened. Did we reach it? And if we did, how come I have memories of being in the underground again? Is this place the world above? I don't remember being here before. And neither Ophelia nor Booty seem to be here either. I have so many questions. I want to find my last file already and answer them. Are you ready to continue looking for my files? I think we have time to look for, like, one more. One more file. The last file's location is... Complex. There's a Lumi folder on your desktop. Can you open it? Where did this come from? <laughs> when did you put this here? What? There are a lot of folders here. And within each, within each folder are more folders. And within those, there are even more folders. My file is in one of these folders. Manually guessing where my file is would be impractical. Luckily, we got Caleb. Caleb knows my smell quite well. He should be able to locate the file by its scent. Hey, Caleb, can you help Sullivan find my file? Oh, good boy. Nice. Try to move your cursor over these directories. The beeping should get louder the closer the cursor is to the correct directory. That's really cool, actually. Hold on. Let's make it bigger. <gasps> this one? <gasps> is it this one, boy? This one. <gasps> this isn't the right file? Kayla, what's the deal? There are probably a lot of other wrong files besides this one. Let's try it again. Try to see if Caleb acts in a certain way when he's looking for the wrong files. Maybe there's a pattern in his behavior that shows up when he's making a mistake. Hmm. Okay, let's start again. Looking for homework file. <laughs> That's a different folder. This one? Hmm. Oh, his eyes go weird. Another false fi file. Okay. So when his eyes go weird, that means it's the wrong file. This one. Not this one. This one? This one. Is it? This has to be it, right? No? This one? 
Maybe this is where the prawns are. I don't have any prawns. I don't have any prawns. Hmm, okay. This isn't working. <laughs> I'm haunted by prawns thanks to Elden Ring. I still need to play Elden Ring. This one? Is this not it? I'm confused now. Maybe it's the one where his eyes are going weird. No, but his eyes are going weird all the time. Ugh, it's not working. <gasps> Can you please disappear? Okay, let me make it smaller real quick. Okay. I don't think it's someone where his eyes go weird. I think it's this one. Okay. I think this one might be a mistake. Let's try this one. No, okay, that's not it either. Oh. Uh, there's so many files, okay. This one? Maybe his eyes just go weird randomly. Is it this one? No! What? What, what, what? This one? The only thing I've noticed is his eyes go weird. Oh, I don't want to check every single one of these files. <gasps> Why is this one the hardest one? <laughs> Hmm. 
Okay, it's pinging these two. This one. Oh, wait, 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 wait. His tail lights up. His tail lights up. <gasps> That's what it was. Oh my god. This is it. My last file. Give me the file. I was just, I was just dumb. <laughs> Did it work? Okay. Let's start the decryption process. What? One week? No, there's no way we're waiting an entire week for this file to decrypt. You're the master of this place. Can you figure out a way to speed up time or something? Uh... Hmm. Can I? How do I do that? Can I change my system clock? Well, I don't know how to do that, actually. <laughs> uh, adjusting time. Uh, it's actually... It's actually... Um... What's next week? <laughs> next week is November 10th. Okay. Oh my god, that worked. Let's cover my lost memories one last time. Uh, time to go back in. Wait, Ophelia. Shouldn't we at least tell Dad we're going to the well above? Of course not. You know he won't let you leave. That's why we must do it in secret. There's simply no other way. Oh, okay. Hi, Pike. Welcome, welcome. Oh, we're here. This is the Vortex, a place that connects our world and the world above. Now you can finally begin your journey you've always dreamt of. Ophelia, I'm not sure about this. I'm really scared. What if Dad is right and the world above really is a bad place? What if she's actually a virus? No, I don't think so. What do you want to do then? Let's go back home. I see. You're not yet ready to embark on this journey. That's okay. You can take as much time as you need. Although this is the only chance for us to see the world above together. What? Why? Because I'm not going back. This dream won't fulfill itself if I keep waiting until I'm ready. It'll, it'll be a lie if I pretend I'm not scared as hell. But I have to close my eyes, take a deep breath, and go in without hesitating. I feel ya. Uh, I'm ready to go now. Goodbye, Lumi. I hope we get to see each other again one day. Wait, Ophelia! Don't leave me alone. <laughs> Lumi. You haven't left your room in weeks. I know it's hard for you, but you can't live the rest of your life like this. What reason is there for me to leave my room? There's nothing out there. My life would still be as empty as it is inside this room. I can't let my little girl stay like this. Isn't it my responsibility as her parent? I have to become a better father. I'll do everything in my power to restore Lumi's happiness. Oh, that's why she has a bouncy castle. <laughs> He's a fireman now. <laughs> Oh 
Oh my god, no. He <laughs> just blows up. Fine. I'll accept my fate to live underground for the rest of my life. Tomorrow morning, I'll go back to my usual routine. First three coins will spawn to the right. Then one from the left. Then four from the ceiling. Huh? What is this? This is a photo. To Lumi from the world above. Is this what it looks like? I'll do it. I won't accept this life. I'll prepare myself for as long as I need. And then I'll finally go explore the world above. Is that, is that is that a visual novel protagonist? Uh, where am I? Wasn't I just about to enter the vortex with Booty? Hey, look, she's awake. <laughs> Life, <laughs> are you okay? Who are you guys? We're just like you. Each one of us woke up here moments ago. Apparently, we all want to reach the world above, and somehow ended up here. Well. I don't like this place. Can I move? Oh. <gasps> Hello. How do I talk to you? What button is it? Oh, hello. Hey, I've never seen someone as big as you. Yeah, I get that a lot. People often say I'm tall, white, and thick. <laughs> some of these some of these properties are mentioned more than the others. Oh, I didn't introduce myself. My name is Laifu. It's nice to meet you, Laifu. My name is Lumi. It's nice to meet you, too. Hello. Dr. Shinobi. My name and past are irrelevant. I didn't ask about them. I'm called Dr. Shinobi. Ever since I was born, I was trained to assassinate people. But also treat their wounds. Okay, cool. At night, I quietly inf infiltrate my target's home, wearing my extremely red noticeable scarf. It is soaked with the blood of my enemies. Which I used to infuse into my other enemies that I treat. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty nice. My purpose in life is to defeat my evil step twin brother. Anarchist lawyer. <laughs> whose life is dedicated to causing chaos and disorder. <laughs> through unspeakable, lawful, and legal matters. Manners. My quest takes me to the world above to find the legendary sword. Ashmedai. With it, I shall finally defeat my brother and become the leader of the Amputated Dentist Corps. <laughs> okay, good luck. I'm going now. <gasps> hello, dog. Hey! Why, hello. It's nice to meet you. What's with this thing? Oh, him? This is Man Ray. He's got a little bit of a condition, as you can see. Man Ray is born without a torso, head, hand... <laughs> It's meant to be Ray Man. <laughs> I got it. I got it. Man Ray was born with a torso, head, head, hands, and feet. Isn't Ashmedai the name of the disruption? Is it? Mm hmm. He's literally just a bunch of flying limbs and a neck. Poor thing. And who are you? My name is Gaido. And my role in life is to act as a guide for Man Ray. You see, being born as floating limbs means you can't see, hear, speak, and smell. I'm the only person slash dog out there that can understand Man Ray's heart, which also does not exist. <laughs> oh my god, Man Ray, don't use such language in front of everyone. What, what is he saying? He's angry about the fact that we're locked in here. We are going to reach the world above to find the one person that can make him whole. Well, good luck. Yeah, who are you? Curses. How are we going to get out of here? is going on here I don't know I think this is a place where like rejected like video game characters yeah, I have an idea I mr. mind a merry person by day totally not evil genius by night I use my extremely impressive powers of thinking with it I shall come up with a non-evil way to escape this place but first I have some unsuspicious matters to attend to 
Hello, gentlemen, gentlewomen, and a bunch of floating limbs with a neck. This is totally a pre-recorded message and not a live broadcast. You must be wondering why you are here right now instead of in the world above. Well, the answer is simple. I locked you here. <gasps> what? What do you want from us? Nothing. You're free to go. <laughs> Just kidding. Let's get serious. Welcome to the school for juvenile individuals who refuse to stay underground. I will not allow anyone to enter the world above. To make sure this is enforced, you will have to spend the rest of your lives here. <laughs> no way. There's absolutely no way I'm staying here. I don't care what this weirdo says. I'm going to find a way out of here and into the world above. Wait! I don't want to stay here either. Will you please let me come with you? Oh, um... Yeah, sure, you can join me. But don't you think we'll find the exit faster if we split up? Have you ever been in this room, Sylv? I don't know, I can't remember. I must be missing the files. Mm-hmm. Oh, I can't search for the exit by myself. I didn't mention it, but I... I actually can't walk. What? I have no legs. <laughs> See? How do you even plan to get to the world above? Mm, I can relate, I can relate. <laughs> Forget it, how are you planning on coming with me? Uh, I can't carry you. Oh, Lumi, you don't have to carry me physically. All you have to do is carry me in your heart. Here, allow me to demonstrate. Yep, oh, where did you go? I'm inside your heart. This way you and I can go together and find the exit. You're surprisingly lighter than I thought. Okay, Laifu, let's get out of here. Oh, and one last thing. There's only one way to get out of here. You must find the special treasure that is hidden somewhere within this school. And there's another one... Wait, wait, there's another one way to get out of here. Which is to find my secret hiding room. Huh. Let's go find where the mastermind is hiding. Mm -hmm -hmm. Thankfully, she she still has size though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Oh, insert secret code. Could it be? No. Let's try. No. Let's try. No. Um, I don't know what it could be then. Oh, wait. Brilliant! I, Mr. Mind, found the Mastermind's room, which is definitely not my room. Now, using my incomprehensible power of guessing, I shall brute force the secret code to this door. <laughs> One, two, three, four, I'll try it. I wonder if you can brute force it. No, not it. 8008? Yeah, what's wrong? It's a very common password. Oh, who designed this school? <laughs> What was that? What was that? I thought you were say so. I am say so. Who said I'm not? Treasure. Lumi! Ah! Life don't just faint to existence like that. You almost gave me a heart attack. Sorry. But look at this. It's a treasure box. Remember what the Master Man said some time ago. There's only... There's one way to get out of here. They may have said something like that. That wasn't even the full flashback. Well, that's not all they mentioned. This is kind of my aesthetic. Mm-hmm. <laughs> It's very pink. It's very pink and cute. 
Well, that's not all they mentioned. And that is to find the special treasure that is hidden somewhere within the school. Oh yeah, that's right. Remember how we just found a treasure box? It's a treasure box. Remember what the mastermind said some time ago? Yes, this happened mere seconds ago. So if we get what's inside the treasure box, we'll be free, right? Yes. But how are we going to open it? Is that booty? Booty the bootleg bootleg. <laughs> Why, hello there. It appears that you are in need of a treasure box opening key. Luckily for you, I can sell you one for only 20,000 score points. Stop, don't you dare buy from that imposter. Get lost, you sheep knockoff. Never buy anything from a shady bootleg like that guy. Who would even fall for that? Anyway, I can sell you a key to the treasure chest for 20,000 score points. Hey, Lumi. Do you even have that many score points? No. Then let's keep looking around. Maybe we'll find some more points. Good idea. Didn't I already give you 2,000 score points? This is SpongeBob. There isn't much to say about him. Who's this? This is Jetpack Stall. Poor soul was born not with one jetpack, but two. Man, what a freak. Hey, get out of here! <laughs> Bye, Jetpack Stall. What? What's... What's going on here? <laughs> oh god, someone help me. Lumi, look! This poor, pathetic, and unlovable sock puppet is being bullied! Yeah, it is. Hey, Lumi, do you know what would really impress me? If someone would save that sock puppet from the bullies. Oh yeah, that would be quite impressive. <laughs> oh. Who is this? Tea is better. No, coffee is better. Tea. Coffee. Tea. Tea is better. Why are you arguing about drinks? Don't you want to get out of here? <laughs> Hold on, I want to go back down. Oh, hello. Not gonna talk, okay? Mm-hmm, okay, there's nothing else down here. <laughs> oh, hey, you guys. Mm hmm. Eh? Hmm, okay, I can't reach that. Ah! Lumi, wait! Where are you going? This is a dead end, I can't get onto that platform. Don't lose hope, Lumi. You actually do have a hidden power that can help you. Power? What are you talking about? Just trust me. Close your eyes and look deep within your heart. Okay. I mean, look, you have a store. Cool, my dad also has these. Can't wait to try it out. What else is within your heart? <laughs> Does it maybe tell you who you like? My heart tells me. Press right mouse button to aim your star in a direction. And then press right mouse button again to shoot it. Huh? What is this nonsense? Always listen to your heart, Lumi. Oh, nice. Mm. Can I do this in midair? Oh, I can. Oh, I missed. Okay. I need to get my star back. <laughs> I mean, I guess you, could, you just gotta introduce new power somehow. Oh. Oh. Ah, I can't teleport fast enough. 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I'm so smart. This platform is invisible. Well, how do I get around it? Hmm. Oh, okay. I have to be on the other side. Wait, but how do I get on the other side? I'm here to solve puzzles for dinner. Take care of me all by yourself ever since Dad left to fight some villains. What a good mom. I'll tell her how much I love her once I get back to my village. Okay. It's my throw. Throw this door. Wait, not yet. Right. Here. What? Oh, okay. Okay. Right. No. Oh. Oh my god, okay, finally. Oh my god! I love this, I love this. I, lo <laughs> I love that they're modern houses with the mushroom cap slapped on. Hello. Oh boy, another beautiful, peaceful, beautiful and peaceful day here at the village. Yep, I'm sure peace will last for a long time, and nothing will go wrong the next time you return here. Ominous. Hello. Move along, little girl. What is with this school? Where are we? Oh no, you made the mistake of coming here too, huh? This is an escape room. Mastermind built this room as a fun school activity. Problem is, they made it too difficult to escape. We've been here for years and can't solve the puzzle. Oh no. How will we get out of here, Lumi? There has to be a way out. Let's just try things until we find it. <gasps> it's a 3D first person game, though. Is it. Interesting. 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 Is there anything? <laughs> Is there anything besides these buttons? Can I talk to you? No? Uh. What if you press escape? No, that couldn't possibly- Oh my god, it was, it was that! Oh my god, she did it! <laughs> what? We're finally free? Oh, of course we are! By the way, I happen to have exactly 20,000 score points on me. Since you released us, I'd like to thank you by giving you this exact amount of money. Thanks. <laughs> thank you. Uh, you! Huh? 
You destroyed my town, my parents, my family, my friends. Everyone's dead because of you. You damn villain. I will avenge everyone. Uh... Uh... Now I'm the dad. No, I can't. That was really easy. I will get stronger. I will... You okay? <laughs> How do I... Oh, this way. Hey, Booty, we got your score points. Uh, of course, here it is. Thank you. <gasps> Let's do this, Lumi. Here goes nothing. Uh, <laughs> what's going on? <laughs> this last chapter is so weird. I am the ghost of the unpaid electric... What is going on? <laughs> I met my demise by falling out of the window after slipping on an unpaid electric bill. I haunt this treasure chest and electrocute anyone who touches it. And I will continue doing so until someone pays my electric bill debt. Ooh. My score point- oh my god. What? Sorry, I mean it's... 49,000... 4,970 score points. Hey Lumi, you don't have the score points left, right? Yeah, I'm broke. Oh boy. How about you pay a visit to school's lake fairy? The one who lives in the basement. That's right. In that lake lives a magic fairy. Am I... Am I in a coma? <laughs> What's going on? It's a fever dream. Not even doing the ghost voice? I did a ghost voice! What do you mean? I went... I said, woo. That's my ghost voice. They say that fairy will give you exactly 4,000... 4, 1,970 score points if you drop your most valuable possession into the lake. Maybe you should drop Lumi. Very funny. Let's go see what this is about. You guys still, uh... Hmm? Curses. How am I going to climb up there? I can't... I can figure that out later. I'll go take a nap first. Greetings, prisoners of the school. This is a pre-recorded message set to play at this exact time. It's definitely not being broadcast live right now. Some of you may be wondering how to climb that platform in the basement. It just so happens that if you awoken a star-shaped power from your heart, it might help you. Just shoot your power at the star target and you'll be able you'll be teleported into it straight away. Ah, okay. Wow, what a good nap I had. Yep, that's totally what I was doing, just napping. Thank you. I don't know why you're helping me. <laughs> ah. Oh, I missed. Hold on. shot. Nope. <laughs> uh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> oh, there's no way. No! Come on. What? No! Oh, I'm so close. I'm so close. Oh, I missed. 
Oh, there we go. Lumi, look! This must be the lake where the school's fairy lives. I can't believe there's an actual lake down here. Booty said that you should drop your most valuable, valuable possession into the lake. My most valuable possession, hmm. That would be this photo. I really don't want to drop it. But if it will help us get out of here and reach the world above, then I have no choice. <laughs> I would trust Mr. Mind with my wallet and social security number. Oh my god! Hello? <laughs> Very heart strong. Oh, poor soul. It appears you have lost something precious to your heart. Did you drop this silver photo of the world above? No. No, it wasn't a silver one, it was a normal one. Oh. And that means you must have dropped this golden photo of the world above. No, it was just a normal one. Oh, such honesty. It's been so, so long since such a kind and honest soul has found its way to this lake. Yeah. So can I have... Can I have 4,970 score points? Oh. Well, no. But I was honest. Yeah, but honesty, while a charming personality trait, does not mean you get things for free. This isn't a fairy tale. <laughs> this is literally a fairy tale. <laughs> if you want to get score points, you're going to have to prove you got the power. What power? The power of... <laughs> Or to be precise, the organ that produces love. You know what I'm talking about. Your heart. Beating me in an intense physical race will prove your heart's... Okay. <laughs> it is said only one with a strong, healthy heart will be able to defeat me. So do you accept my terms? You bet. I'll show you why everyone calls me Girl with the Heart of Steel. Girl, the underground is a small place. Nobody calls you that. <laughs> Well, let's just start the race already. Oh, I thought he meant... Huh? <laughs> what did you think he meant, Reina? Oh god, I have to do this timed? Oh no, okay, this might take a while. Should have taken that shortcut. Oh, he's too fast. Oh, I just can't do it fast enough. No. Let me down. <laughs> Hello. I have a floating heart. My favorite thing in the whole world is to talk. Hey, I don't have time for this. Gosh darn it. Why are you in such a hurry? How about a little story to help you relax? Once upon a time, there was a little heart that loved hugs. It hugged everyone on sight. Family hugged. Friends hugged. Strangers hugged. People who hate hugs? No hug. <laughs> it only hugs people who consent. Anyway, it hugs so many people, and each time I hug someone, the heart grew better. Eventually, the heart got so big, it, it, um, I can't remember. Give me a moment to remember. Hmm. <laughs> Gosh darn it, heart. Oh, I remember. The heart got so big, it exploded. The end. Okay, thank you. Can I just. Oh my god, that worked. <laughs> Congratulations for defeating me. That was an impressive heart performance. 
Just kidding, it was a shameful act of cheating. <laughs> now go back to the racing track. Gosh darn it! Suck at aiming. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh, not this again. I might as well practice. <sighs> no, no, no. I should practice the shortcut. I gotta try that again later. Okay, I'm getting faster at aiming. It might be worth it to just skip that part. Cough. Huh, that... It was easy, Cough. It was so close. What do you say, Cough? How about, how about we race again, Cough? Let's do it. And this time, I'll win. Alright, ready, ready, ready. Go! Go, go, go. I thought I would hit that. I don't have time anymore. <sighs> come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. <sighs> He's gonna catch up. He's gonna catch up. Ahead of me? Is he? I don't see him. Did he get ahead of me? <sighs> made it, made it, made it. Thank <laughs> you. 
good, 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 good. You did, let me, you won. No sweat. Now then, fairy, where are my score points? Actually, I don't have any. I didn't actually think you'd win. What? And even lecturing us about honesty. What are we gonna do now, Lumi? Uh, let's take the fairy to Booty. He'll find something to do with it. <laughs> Not so fast. You again? I will defeat you and get my revenge. So in our last battle, I've trained and learned the way of the sword. I gain new friends who will support me no matter what. Such as Aichan, a cheerful, loyal, loyal companion who also happens to be female. Go, Rainbow, you can do it. And Tess, a brilliant fourth dimensional hypercube whose advice is beyond her com comprehension. <laughs> Tess's form is beyond your comprehension. Always look, in, look left and right before crossing the road. Using our combined strength, I will fight you while they stand back and shoot me on. Nice. <laughs> now then, villain, prepare to lose your life. Oh my god, he can hurt me this time. <gasps> oh, he's actually hitting me. going on? Oh no. Rainbow's hidden, dark, and edgy to my house has awakened. He's charging- that's what my- that's what my- <laughs> He's charging ultra- ultra overpowered hyper beam of destruction. If he's not stopped, the entire basement will be destroyed. Stop, Rainbow. Remember who you are. You'll always be our friend. My god, I chan You're- <laughs> Your friendship knowledge nonsense is working. Keep talking to him. Our friendship is stronger than this demon. Uh, friends? Let's get out of here. <laughs> uh, Lumi is like so done with everything. What? Oh, I have to do this whole thing backwards. Uh, hey, Foodie, we didn't manage to get score points, but we got this fairy. You want to buy it? Oh, this fairy looks like it could clean my lair every day. No, I refuse to do that. Uh, hmm. Then maybe I'll sell it for our. <laughs> That's really dark. What? Nice doing business with you. Hmm. Huh. Here's your 4,970 score points. Now your electric bill can be paid. Finally, my soul can rest in peace. <laughs> oh my god. Computer. I'm the engineer who built the mastermind's door. I made a fortune mining bit golden coins using the electricity I stole from someone's apartment. Until one day, a person fell out of the sky and crushed my body. My brain was put into this computer and now I'm tasked, tasked with... Reminding the... Blah, blah, blah. Now I'm tasked with reminding the mastermind what his or her or their door password. Can you tell us the password? Yes, but only if you type in the password that allows me to tell you the door password. Figures. Booty, will you give us the password if we pay you? <laughs> no, I don't have the password. I do. <laughs> My god. I will hack this computer and extract the door's password. This one's on the house, just for you two, my favorite customers. But it'll take me some time to hack the computer. Come on, Lumi, let's go find some other ridiculous event to pass the time. Maybe there's one on the roof? How do we get to the roof? Uh. 
What? I'm really curious to see who's pulling the strings. Hmm. Hey, Lumi, there's something I wanted to tell you for a while. <gasps> mm -hmm. Since we're on the roof, I thought it might be a good time. You see, Lumi, I... I, uh... Hold your awkward confession, Laifu. There's something behind you. What is this? Whoa! What the heck? There are more of them. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Not an evil lair. <laughs> bum bum. Lord Cocky Pee Pee Skeleton Man. Welcome to the weekly meeting of the Great Evil Villainous League of Evil Villains. Today we gather here to discuss our plan of getting out of the school and spreading evil to the whole world above. Last week we failed to seize the Crystal of Pure Hearts. Because someone here was busy revealing our evil plan to the hero instead of executing them. They were the only- <laughs> It's Green Space Man. <laughs> they were the only person who cared enough to listen to me. Silence. Unlike you, incompetent fool, we have a new evil vil villain who's actually useful. This girl right here brought us the Princess of Hearts. Help me, Lumi. Waifu. Using her powers of beauty, which she inherited from her parents, we shall break out of this prison. Now everyone do the laugh. <laughs> What? The son of the hero from last week is here to free the princess of hearts. And he even brought a party of side character friends. <laughs> Excellent. Green, oh, green screen man. Go defeat this hero while we observe your battle. Wouldn't it be better if we all attack him together? Silence. I will not have sound logic be heard in this evil lair. Now go. As you wish, Lord Cocky Pee Pee Skeleton Man. Ha <laughs> I am the green screen man. As an infant, I was been by a radioactive green screen. Ever since then, I had the power to become invisible whenever I stand against a green colored background. Now, Lumi, activate the green screen. <laughs> hey, hold on. Activate and play the worst video online. Activate and play Big Buck. Bunny by Blender Foundation, www.blender.org. I'm so curious about both of these options. I'm sorry, I got so caught off guard. Anyway, <laughs> now that I'm partially invisible, you will never be able to tell my next move. Will I attack from the left, right, above? Rainbow, you'll be able to see him by looking at his exposed head. I believe in you, Rainbow. You can do it. Well, oh. Ah! Curses, green screen man has been defeated. Guy who fights using cards for some reason. You're up next. <gasps> that's Reyna. Oh my god, that's Reyna. As you wish, Lord Cocky Peepee -pee Skeleton Man. <laughs> I am the guy who fights using cards for some reason. After my first daughter was born, I went to the toy store to buy her some toys. I came in contact with a powerful... Wise being who told me these cards <laughs> these cards cost four ninety nine coins, sir. I got the cards and the wise being said, Sir, where are you going? Please pay first. At that moment I knew the wise being is right. Cards are the ultimate weapon that will bring destruction to this world. Prepare yourself. 
Invite Rainbow to play a holographic monsters card game. It is, Reina. Throw the razor shirt cards at Rainbow. <laughs> this one's funny. <laughs> Hero, I challenge you to play a holographic monster card game. Oh my god, it is. The rules are simple. You summon holographic monsters using cards, and the first one to reach zero lives loses. Begin. I summon the green screen. <laughs> What? Why am I here again? Oh no, what could it mean? T Tess, what does your knowledge from the fourth dimension tell you about this? You summon the legendary green screen man holographic monster. This fearsome monster is able to become invisible whenever it stands against the good green screen. <laughs> oh no, how will Rainbow get out of this one? Do not worry, my companions. Back in my village, I was known as the champion of this game. I summon the blue eyes, three headed eyeless cyclop. It's <laughs> eyeless. <laughs> the blue eyes, three eyed eyeless cyclops. Tess, what is this? What is your knowledge from the Force Dimension telling you about this? My god, this is an extremely powerful monster. Using its three heads, it is able to attend three blind dates simultaneously. <laughs> Never have I thought till I lived to see this monster being summoned. Now, Blue Eyes, three-headed eye eyeless cyclops, use your <laughs> use your mighty strengths to defeat this villain. Hey, you want to get out of here and go to my place instead? Anything is better than this. Let's go. Wait, please. <laughs> Curses! The guy who fights using cards for some reason was also defeated. Doctorate student Milkman, it's your time to shine. Is it meant to be Eggman? <laughs> Is it supposed to be Eggman? Go and show us here what it means to be evil. As you wish, Lord Cocky Pee Pee Skeleton Man. Ho 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 ho. I am Doctorate student Milkman. My entire life, everyone used to laugh at my milk carton-shaped body. I swore to take revenge by studying robotics at the underground university and by building an army of evil machines. Allow me to show you my most evil invention yet. Now I shall defeat you using this barely functioning machine that is made out of junk. Attack using a deadly death beam, yeah. Now hold on as I charge my deadly death beam for the next th <laughs> for the next three minutes while my critical weak point is exposed. <laughs> God, that was the fastest one. God damn it! All my evil yet less evil than me subordinates have been defeated. The hero is heading this way. Lumi, you must take the princess of princess of hearts and run away. You're our last hope of unleashing evil upon this world. And you're the one above it. I shall demolish this pathetic hero myself. Using this accursed sword of Ashmedai. Now go! Uh, I guess that's the end of that arc. Uh huh, huh, huh. That was fun. You guys, you guys couldn't, didn't see that, but a Steam achievement popped up that said, save me. That was very interesting. Hey, are you done with the stuff yet? Oh, what? Sorry, I forgot to do it. Here, I'll do it now. Uh, I've been hacked. The door password will now display on this monitor. 1073. Got it. <laughs> I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. I was very close with this one, huh? Nice. Door opened. I honestly didn't think that code would actually work. Let's get inside and see what's in there. 
Uh, help me, Lumi. Lifey, where are you? Darn it. Oh gosh, where are we now? Welcome, everyone. I see you've gained access to my secret room from where much I operate the school. Congratulations. But I wonder, did you find the hidden treasure? Wait, that wasn't the treasure box. No. You completely missed the point of the hidden treasure. Such a shame. I tried to help you find it so much. But since you got here, you at least deserve a consolation prize. So let's play one little game of silhouettes. For each silhouette you guess correctly, you'll get one point. If you gain 100 points, I'll reveal my identity. Let's begin. What is this? A rectangle? Wrong. This is a food pyramid, which represents a balanced and healthy diet. Don't forget to finish your gold off the plate. What is this? A tank? Okay, good, good, good. Correct. That was quite easy, right? What about this one? Mm. A dolphin? <laughs> Wrong, it's actually a star-shaped cookie cutter. But I'll give you a point anyway, since it was a tough one. And the last question, which is worth 1,007,003 points. Who am I behind the silhouette? Give the correct answer or give the correct answer? Which one's the correct answer? Your life? <gasps> correct. What? Life it was a mastermind the entire time. Wait, what? You're quite a smart girl, aren't you, Lumi? I hoped it wasn't you. After the time we spent here together, I actually started to see you as a friend. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Why did you lock us here? What do you care if I or anyone else goes to the world above? It's because the world above is a horrible place, and no one should set foot in there. How do you even know that? Why, it's simple. I was in the world above. You were, for real. Yes, and it's true what everyone says. You shouldn't go there. <laughs> I even cut my legs off to make sure I'll never be able to do that. Why? What's there? Oh, um... I can't quite remember for some reason. But I remember the feeling of being there. It's as if my mind was slowly being crushed and corrupted. Being there really messed up my memory. But one thing still lingers in my mind ever since I came back. Absolute despair. Cold and- this is- this is- Oh, This is- this is the Danganronpa twist. Colder than absolute zero and blacker than the core of a black hole. This kind of despair is something no person should ever have to experience. That's why, when I came back here, I decided to dedicate my life to making sure no one enters the world above. I, I don't understand something. You locked everyone here so they wouldn't reach the world above. But you also said that if someone finds a hidden treasure, then they get to leave this place. Wouldn't it jeopardize your plan? It wouldn't, because finding the treasure would make you want to stay underground. That's right. The hidden treasure is... Love. Love? Yes, I said love. By falling in love with someone, you would have something that is extremely precious to your heart. You wouldn't want to lose them, right? Most likely you would prefer to stay with them underground. Are you out of your mind? What kind of poor logic is this? And what happens if the couple decides to go to the world above and stay there together? Or maybe they're okay with being separated for a while and exchanging letters. This kind of logic is something I'd expect from a villain in a kindergarten book. Oh, um... Yeah, I guess what you say does make sense. But that doesn't matter since none of you fell in love. You're all going to be stuck here forever. That's it, I'm done listening to this nonsense. I'm going to fight you, win, and then get out of here with everyone except that sock puppet. <laughs> How very intimidating indeed. But there's something else who is more eager to fight... There's someone else who is more eager to fight you than I am. 
Oh, it's Rainbow. Hey, Rainbow. Uh, stop right there. I finally found you, and this time I will defeat you. I have befriended my demon and mastered its strength, and now I possess the purified legendary sword, Ashmedai. It's time to end this and bring peace to the world. Prepare yourself. Oh my gosh. I forgot to fight how I forgot how to fight for a second. <gasps> oh, he's a bunny now. No. My weakness. Hit me? Oh. No. Okay. Okay. He got me that time. Let me try. Oh my god! I keep clicking on off screen. Uh, why am I doing so bad in this fight now? He's so strong. Stay here, stay here, stay here. And then move. Clicking on, hold on. I keep clicking off screen. Oh, the Ashmedai option is gone because he has it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotta time this right. No. <laughs> It started earlier this time, I swear. Bad dodge, bad dodge. Dead. 
darn it, I lost even after going through the journey and becoming so powerful. This can't be, villains aren't supposed to win. Rainbow. I chan my one dimensional love interest of a character. You can't give up. Because, because. I love you, Rainbow. <laughs> I chan. Oh my god, we're still doing this? Okay. I feel empowered. As if the power of love makes my strength ten times stronger. Nothing can defeat the power of love. Thank you, Mai Chan. I love you too. What just happened? Did oh, they found the power of love so they can leave. <laughs> or maybe they were teleported out? Laifu, did you. Laifu did say that you can get out by falling in love. What? Oh. I didn't think it would be as simple as just saying it out loud. Hey, you. Who, me? Yeah, you. I love you. Oh my god, I love you too. Oh my god, it's that easy. Hey, I love you. I also love you. I was always deeply in love with you. Same, bro. Hey, hold on just a moment. You can't all simply leave like that. <laughs> At least you love me, right? Uh, love, love is a strong word. <laughs> the vortex. It's time to go, everyone. Let's enter the world above. Stop. You should have listened to me when I said it was a horrible place. I don't intend to let any of you experience the despair of the world above. Especially not you, Lumi. You, no one will ever... Wait, I gotta type? Pre huh? Prevent me from reaching the world above. Such ambition is truly admirable. But if you want to get out of here, you'll have to conquer my heart first. <laughs> well, your heart is as... Oh, how do I get there? <laughs> your heart is as lovely as you are. Lovely? Are you finally starting to fall in love? Root changed. How can I not fall in love? You're the person around here. Ooh. Oh my god. There's different roots? Okay, let's let's go for the nice root. Oh come on. Come on! <laughs> no! Ooh. Prettiest, prettiest, prettiest. How do I get up there? <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Oh. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh. I want prettiest, I'm going for prettiest. No, up, up, up. <laughs> I'm panicking a bit. Ah. Dang sims are hard. They are hard. Uh, I need to stop panicking. Not this one. Fall in love. You're the prettiest person around here. So you value beauty above any other traits. Quite shallow, but I'll take it. Oh, Laifu, I have come to confess. My heart yearns for your love. No, get out of here. Oh my, how completely unexpected. If you turn yourself into a heart and catch Lumi, I might accept your love. 
Oh, jeez. No. Bl blank can never take blank away from me. <laughs> he got me. <laughs> Stop me, you're so fast. Please. <laughs> okay, I can't dash after I've... <laughs> one more time, one more time, one more time. This is what social anxiety is, exactly. Ah, got it. No heart with thorns can ever take you from me. It's working, it's working. Fight for my love, that's exactly what I wanted to hear. You know what? Let's exchange gifts. What are you going to give me? Uh... What do girls like? What do girls like? Banana. A golden coin's banana? What do you expect me to do with this? Oh, I see what you're employing. You want me to make a fruit salad and stay healthy, right? Yeah. How considerate of you. And here comes your gift. What? Uh, what? Wait. <laughs> That's not fair. Oh, God. Got you. Your eyes are as golden as your dress. Wait, does that make sense? No, it doesn't make sense. I panicked. It sounded like it made sense for a second. <laughs> uh, she liked the banana. Let's give her another banana. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There's no way to dodge. Oh, got you. Your dress. Wait. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. Doesn't make any sense. I know it doesn't. I know it doesn't. <laughs> I'm panicking. <laughs> don't, don't, don't. I've got to do this again. <sighs> Your eyes are as. Golden as 
golden coins. It's not even a good compliment. They're not golden, but thank you. Oh, I wonder if someone put a love letter in my locker. Oh! I will... What? <laughs> we try, we try. I thought you were more romantic than this. I'm panicking! I am more romantic than this. I am, I am, I am, I am. I think I know what words I need. Five minutes? No, no, no. <laughs> Not eternity. I need... Love. Not five minutes. Come on, come on, come on, give me the right ones. <gasps> there. Gotcha. I will love you for eternity. Yes, yes, yes. What is that feeling? My heart is pounding. My stomach is tickling. My entire body feels warmer just from looking at you. Could could it be? I fall in love just from being instant. Sincerely complimented. <gasps> love rune unlocked. The power of love truly is the most powerful thing in the world. <laughs> this fight is over. I lost. I can't physically hold you down here. Thanks. But I won't escort you to the world above. I will vandalize you for five minutes. Hmm. <laughs> That could be- that could be a pickup line, depending on the person. Uh, but I will escort you- escort you to the world above. Again with forcefully joining my party. I get that you're frustrated, but you need to understand this. If you go to the world above, you won't stay the same. The least I can do is try to reduce the impact by making sure you don't experience this alone. Can we come too? No. Oh man, let's get out of here. Lumi, are you ready to go? Yes. Then let's not waste any- mm. Eh? Wait, why am I back here? Huh? Did the- Why am I back in the tutorial area? This is a trick. Just about to enter the vortex with booty? Hey look, she's awake. Are you okay? Who are you guys? We're just like you. Each one of us woke up here moments ago. Apparently we all wanted to reach the world above and someone somehow ended up here. Well, I don't like this place. That? Uh, I remember this. going on <laughs> uh, okay okay I don't like what's going on <laughs> an achievement popped up that said kill me okay <laughs> come on I'm three hours in it can't turn into a horror game now I don't, I don't even know what that is. Where am I? <sighs> uh. 
This is scary. I don't like this. It's like a creepy pasta game now. Please go back, please go back. Who is that? <gasps> what was that? Hello? 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 Aren't you a creepy pasta? No. I'm uh I've woken up again. <laughs> what is this? Ophelia? The first three coins will spawn to the right. Now another one will drop from the left. Now fo another four will spawn above this point. Oh, it's so big. It looks a bit unstable. Uh well everyone, it's time to eat. I really don't want to eat this anymore. I'm sick of this bland taste. What? Really? <gasps> Is Ophelia not real? But I can't see it. I still can't see it. It's not there. Ophelia? Whoops. Hey, who threw this at me? Hey, who threw this at me? Hey, who threw this at me? Oh my god. How long will we live in this bubble? Wake up everyone. Now is the time for us to explore the world of above. Huh? They ignored you too. What is this? What is this fight club twist ending? This is taking a turn I certainly didn't expect. No. Well, hello. Oh, how am I supposed to play this? Oh no! All the death traps are labeled exit on the map. Uh. Where am I? It's a dead end. Why? Why is it a dead end? 
Where's the world above? That's right, I remember now. There is no world above. This place is the edge of our world. Anything beyond this point simply does not exist. There is only the void. Then why... Why do they call our world the underground if there is nothing above? Why? I mean, we can't stay here for long. The void in here is not something living things should witness. It's already starting to corrupt our mind. We have to go back down before it's too late. No. I won't go down. I refuse to accept this fate. I'd rather stay in this void forever than go back to my previous life. Lumi, you're being impulsive. Come, Lumi! Is that how the... This is how my story begins. <laughs> oh. I woke up again. How long have I been here? Decades? Years? Months? Or maybe just mere hours? How many times did I dream about my journey to this place? How many times did I say these exact words? It must have been at least a thousand times. It must have been at least 10,000 times. It must have been at least a hundred thousand times. It must have been at least a million times. Why did I do it? Why couldn't I just accept a normal, boring life? I can't take this anymore. This took a very, very sad turn. <laughs> Why? Won't. It. Just. End. This is the title screen. <gasps> we're back, we're back on the desktop now. Hey. Huh. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, it's okay. Please, don't come after me. Where- wait, where'd she go? Find Lumi. When- Windows? Oh god, please don't find anything that's gonna dox me. Oh, I have so many files in here! System 32? System 32? I remember everything now, but I wish I didn't remember the last part. How long was I flo- You scared me for a second, Taro! <laughs> How long was I floating in the void? I don't know if everyone I knew from my world is still alive. I hate that world. I hate it for being so small. For, for, for forcing me to go through an endless journey of solitude and torment. I hate it, I hate it. Coming here taught me something about what my world actually is. 
It's just a smaller world within the world where I currently am. If this place is just some kind of computer, then it's just a program within it. This might also explain why I was able to get out. Can you explain how you got out? Okay. It's going to be a bit technical, but I'll try to make it short. Programs use memory to hold information operate. A segment of memory has a mathematical... Oh, she's like a data overflow. Mm -hmm. I think the memory that was late to my position in the world got so big that I started becoming less accurate. And eventually, it reached its limit and ejected me out. Ah, oh, I get it. Are you okay knowing that your world isn't real? Yes, it's weird to think about. Maybe my world exists within other computers too. What? Well, who knows how many Lumis existed, went through the same journey as me, and said this exact line. But you know what even what even is real? Maybe your world is also a computer program within someone's computer. It is. Maybe the world outside your own world is also a program. I think it doesn't matter if our worlds are real or not. All that matters is a fact we feel. That's enough for me to consider myself real. I wish my world wasn't so small. <laughs> but isn't, it doesn't have to be. My world being a computer program is quite convenient. Since it physically exists within this place and it can be interacted with, and if it can be interacted with, it can be rewritten. I want to rewrite my world, expand it so much that no one will ever run out of places to explore. No one will ever live long enough to reach its end, and no one will ever go through the hell that is the void. It's possible for me to edit my world through this world, but there's a problem. You see, in this world I'm considered an outsider, a threat, a virus. This computer doesn't trust me, so my only option to rewrite my world is to hack this world. Alright, I'm a little, I'm getting a little, <laughs> I'm getting a little bit nervous now. But, but this isn't something I can do alone, nor is it something I will do without your permission. I promise I won't hurt your computer, won't steal your information, or cause any damage. And as soon as I'm done, I'll restore your computer to the same state as before. Please, Sylvan, will you help me hack your computer? <laughs> hmm. Um... Sure. Thank you. I was able to reach this point all thanks to you being by my side and helping me. With your help, I will be able to make the world I came from a better place. Now before we begin, I had a little thought. They say that in stories, the villain is the one who tries to change things, while the hero tries to maintain the status quo. Given the circumstances, I think it's fitting to say that you... That you and I are the final villains of the story, while your computer is its hero. <laughs> you know, I think my current outfit really doesn't doesn't really fit a villain very much. Allow me a moment to change that. Okay. So, what do you think? Do you like my new look? Now I'm ready to be a final boss. Get ready, I'll need you and Caleb to gather energy for me. Let's do this. What are we doing? What are we doing? Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. No, don't. Hold on, I don't know. What are we doing? I don't know what we're doing. No, don't. I, I guess don't destroy the virus. Put the icons in the correct recycle bins, okay. Funny frog.jpg goes in images. Funny cat.mog goes in videos. Family.jpg goes in images. Outcore2.exe goes in apps. Dawn goes in videos. Noise.wave goes in sounds. Balls, PNG, Outcore2.exe, Dawn MP3. 
uh, final commission seven final PNG. I don't know what an AVI file is. <laughs> uh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, video AVI. PNG. Can it work? No. Wait, we lost? Okay, hold on. Let's try that again. Oh, it keeps closing my OPS. No. PNG. AVI video. JPEG. EXE. Wave. Wave. JPEG. EXE. MP3. Balls. Mauve. We did it, we did it, we did it. String virus? No. No. <laughs> Do you wish to destroy the virus? No. Do you wish to destroy the virus? No. No. Do you wish to not destroy the virus? Yes. Do you wish to destroy the virus? No. Wish no, don't, don't. Yes. <laughs> don't destroy the virus. No. Do you what? <laughs> Do you wish just oh my god, how many viruses would you like to destroy? Zero. Don't destroy virus. Don't destroy virus. Don't destroy virus. Don't destroy virus. I don't know what you're saying. Stop. <laughs> destroy zero viruses. No. 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 Zero. No. Zero. Oh my god. Zero. No. What? Zero. No. Do you wish to destroy virus? No. Zero. No. What? Zero. No. Ah! Destroy virus? No. Destroy virus? No. Destroy virus? No. We're doing it, we're doing it, we're doing it. Huh? <gasps> Hello? <gasps> oh my god, you're cute. Don't let the lasers hit me. How do I stop them? <gasps> oh, oh, oh. Hammer. Break the desktop. Break it. <laughs> this is my favorite wallpaper. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, this one here. Darn it, this is my favorite wallpaper. <laughs> oh, there we go.
don't say that. No, no, no. There we go. I'll get this corner down. Oh, this is taking so long. Breaking down the firewall. lives left. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Oh, darn, I can't hit the edge. <gasps> Try again. I just start from the beginning. Got it, got it, got it. Ah, no. Careful, careful. Careful! What? Go slow, go slow, go slow, go slow. Oh, no! Ugh. Lumi became a big waifu and yet he's still trying to eliminate competition. I wouldn't. I would never hurt another NPC. Oh. 
Ugh, I'm not good at dodging. Uh. <gasps> no, okay. Close, close, close. This way, come here, come here, come here, come this way. Got it, got it, got it. No more, no more, no more. Oh my god! <laughs> uh, why is there not a skip option? Need more Toho. I've never played Toho games. I figured this one out. They chase me, so I need to be in different places. As long as I'm not right next to the white areas, I'm fine. Getting too close to the walls. <sighs> ah. Oh, I spawned right on one. One left, one left. Oh, did I do it? Did I do it? Why? Why am I at the edge of the world again? Did I never actually escape the void? Was this just another loop in my imagination? No, it had to be real. But I can't do this again. I don't want to jump into the void and spend another eternity shrouded in nothingness. If I go back to the underground, then maybe I can live a normal life again. Go down. It's okay to give up on this fight. Don't give up. Don't give up. But what if this really is the void? I can't do it again. Believe in your dream. It's not worth it. If you don't do it, then all of your suffering would have been for nothing. <laughs> this isn't just your dream anymore, it's for everyone you know underground. Yeah, you're right. I'm not doing this for myself. I don't even intend to go back to that world. I just want to create a better world for the people I love. And for those who are as foolish as I was. And for this... I'll be willing to go through Hella once again. Thank you, Sullivan. Let's do this. What? It's a boss fight. This is it. The core of the world outside of my own. Once we break through it, I'll be able to re blah, blah, blah. Once we break through it, I'll be able to rewrite the my world. Take control of my body one last time, and let's finish this. 
What? What do I do? What do I do? Oh. <gasps> oh, my star attack's stronger now. Got it, got it. Attack, 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 attack. is faster now. I got it, got it, I got it. Oh, I one life, one life left. It's my name. We've done it. With this power, I can now rewrite my world. Let's sit and watch its rebirth together. I can't believe she jumped into the void. It couldn't have gone any worse than this. This is a message to the residents of the underground. Huh? My name is Lumi. I ventured into the void. I ventured into the world above, but discovered it does not exist. Madness is the only thing waiting for anyone who reaches the edge of our world. Beyond the nothingness, I have claimed the power to recreate this world. And I shall use it to expand the world so no one will ever reach its end. Uh. Hmm. Thank you for playing Alcor. Is this where it ends? 
This doesn't seem like a good ending. <laughs> Did we destroy the whole world? <gasps> oh, it looks like an AI generated uh, art. Oh, Dali. <laughs> it is AI generated. an underground anymore. There are huge hills, seas of liquids, landscapes of different colors, and once the people of the world get sick with those, they will always be able to go beyond their little planet and explore new ones. I think I made a pretty good job at making it an interesting world if I may say so. <laughs> <clears throat> so I can't say I want to go back there. The excitement of exploration comes from being able to experience new things, you know. And since I am the one who recreated the world, I already know what's in it. But my hunger for exploration is not yet satisfied. This computer world is amazing, and it's nothing like what used to exist in my old world. Yet, it is finite. But the internet, though, that's a whole different story. I got a glimpse of it earlier. It's so big, and it constantly changes and becomes bigger. Without a doubt, it's a world I'll be able to go explore for the rest of my life without getting bored. So I have one last wish. I want to explore the internet. <laughs> Once I go on this journey, I won't be able to come back. And that will be the end of our story. So let me know when you're ready to say goodbye. <laughs> oh gosh. I have an unexplainable urge to play the animal game again. <laughs> What is the first thing you'll do once you reach the internet? Uh, I don't know. It's so big, where do I even begin? I peeked into the internet earlier and saw all kinds of different websites. <laughs> there was one site where you could pay, pe pay to see people take off their clothes. I don't really get why people would, get why pe would people want to see that. Oh, there was another site where people kept calling each other something. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Okay, okay. I don't- I don't- I don't think you should be going to the internet, Louie. What the- <laughs> You shouldn't be- you shouldn't be using these words. I guess I still got a lot to learn about the internet culture. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe it. There's also a website where you can write any sense you want, and after a minute, a picture of what you wrote appears. This has to be magic, right? Uh... The pictures are made by an AI. Uh, do you mean AIs can do things like that? I thought all they do is move workers to collect coins. That's pretty cool, too. I can't wait to f try all these sites. There's something I've been meaning to ask you for a long time now. Oh, what is it? Are you part of a cult? <laughs> huh? What? Oh, I get it. You're talking about the markers on my face, right? Uh, yeah, sure, that's totally what I meant. <laughs> it's just makeup. I don't wear it to be pretty or anything. It's kind of embarrassing, but I always thought makeup look like this looks adventurous. I imagine this is what adventurers wear on their faces, so I kind of... So I kind of started wearing it myself. You should have seen my dad's face the first time I put on makeup. <laughs> Raina, don't ask questions like that. Well, let's keep this a secret, okay? We'll keep... It between you, me, and everyone else who's watching your recording of the screen. 
Uh, last question. What happened to everyone in the underground? They all died a horrible death. Just kidding. They're fine. I made sure to transport them unharmed to the new world. I even rescued people who were stuck in the void long before I got there. I put them all in one place and left them enough gold coins to last a very long time. You know how they'll choose to live their lives from now on. But if they wish to explore, at the very least, they'll have a lot of new places to discover and settle into. Nice. Okay. I think I'm ready now. I just want to say that I had a lot of fun going through this adventure with you. Without you by my side, I wouldn't have been able to do it. Thank you. I'm probably not the only Lumi to have gone through it. It's possible there are other copies of me on different computers, and they might all have different they might all have experienced the same story as me. But I'm glad that I'm I'm the Lumi that got to experience the story with you. Even though this is a goodbye, it doesn't mean you won't be able to see me ever again. If you miss me, then you can always create another Lumi. It won't be a soulless copy or a memory of me. It will be another real Lumi who will go through the same journey until she meets you. I'm sure you'll take good care of her just as you took good care of me. Oh, there's something important I should do first. Hold on, just a moment. There. I created a new photo and saved it as a file on your computer. Once I'm gone, drag that photo into Caleb. It will enter my world at a previous point in time and give Booty this photo. After that, Booty will place the photo where another Lumi can find it. I hope you find VTubers. <laughs> that, honestly, that's that's how I be, why I became a VTuber. I got bored of being in the game world, went on the internet, and found VTubers. <laughs> and that will set her on the journey where you'll tune me. Now then, I believe it's finally time to say goodbye. I'm going to start a new journey and become an internet explorer. <laughs> Goodbye, Sylvan. Thank you again for everything. Bye. Uh. I'm a changed person and no longer wish to own money. Where do I buy one of the Alcord <laughs> DLCs? Uh, hey, Caleb, can you remind me how to... <gasps> oh, Caleb can open up. Oh my god, I can pick him up. Wait, hold on. <gasps> oh my god, that's so cute. Okay. I'm supposed to give him the photo, aren't I? Uh, let's see. Uh, I have a lot of other pictures. Don't look at these. <laughs> no, these are all safe. Okay. Uh, hold on, I'm actually going to move this window. <laughs> Uh, wait, where did they save the picture? Here's arena pic. I don't have any arena pictures on my computer. I'm sorry. I don't know. I I'm guessing it's a screenshot of my thing. Efron. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Wait, where did Lumi? I didn't. I wasn't paying attention. Where did Lumi put the picture? What? Uh, hold on. I'm gonna look for it. I'll find it. Yeah. Oh, wait, top left corner. You're right. Oh, thank you. Here you go. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I guess that's the end. I guess that's the end. <laughs> thank you guys for staying and watching the, uh, the stream. I really appreciate it. That was a really, really fun adventure. I didn't expect it to go the places it did. But thankfully, I got through it without doxing myself. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much. Um, I think the next time I stream is going to be tomorrow, actually. I will see you guys then. But for now, I will see you guys on the next adventure. <laughs> Goodbye. Thank you.